Good evening YouTube, I'm Ursa Ryan and here is a quick guide of how to turn off the auto unit cycle from Civ 6. It's pretty simple, it's not on the actual interface in the game, you have to come via the back door but it's actually really easy. If you go to this PC, I'm sure there's an Apple alternative mechanism of doing this, I have no idea how Apples work, I'm afraid this is Windows only. Go to this PC and when you go into my documents, you go to my games and then set my civilization 6. And you go to this little file at the bottom called user options and go into that. Be very careful not to muck with anything else in here other than what you want to because these are all the options of the game and if you start messing with this you might corrupt the game entirely, I am sure. Now along here somewhere is, where is it, does the selection auto cycle to the next available unit. Zero for no, one for yes. If you go into this and you have got auto unit cycle on, it'll be showing one, like so. All you've got to do, turn it to zero, go file, oh, and then save, like that, and your problem is solved. Nice and simple. That should basically stop the whole thing. I mean, I have no idea why they haven't put it into the user interface. I mean, look at some of these other options. You've got skips movement animations, skip combat animations. All this sort of thing is in the game. That's all that is, is quick movement and quick combat. They've, they've programmed all this stuff in, but they just haven't put it in the interface. I have no idea. Take a look through, see what other goodies you can find. If you're better with computers than I am, I'm sure they've got interesting things in here. But I hope that helped. See you later. Bye!